Hey friends, it's your girl Tanya with an eye and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. Thanks for stopping by. If you're a returning guest, thanks for coming back. Okay. So today I am in Collingswood, New Jersey at Sabrina's Cafe and I'm excited. I've heard such great things. You know, I've asked a couple of friends and they told me about this place. So I'm definitely looking forward to whatever they have in store for me. So let's go. Alrighty friends, so here is the menu. It's a pretty big menu. And when I mean big menu, I mean the menu is big. The size, the paper, I should say. The paper is big. But the menu is it's a good size menu. There is breakfast on one side. And then there is lunch and dinner on the other side. But I'm not here for that. I'm here for the breakfast. So I decided to get the challah French toast top with the powdered sugar and I also decided to add some chocolate chips on there because you know I like a little sweetness with my, my breakfast and stuff and then I also got some eggs because you know I need some eggs in my life and I think this is what makes this menu so cute is that they gave a little backstory oops right here backstory about you know who Sabrina is you know and it's really cute I read it earlier um yeah, so I'm going to pause it here. You know, feel free to pause the video so you can read yourself. I'm not doing that. That's doing too much. So, yes, Sabrina's Cab. Um, I know they have other locations. I believe the little bio here says they have um, maybe four, three or four. One is, uh, two's in PA, one's in Jersey. So, yes, great stuff. I'm excited. I'm always excited about food. For all those people out there, the way to my heart is through my stomach. Hint, 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 hint. Check me out, I'm joking. All right, waiting for food. Alrighty, so for all those people that love a good beverage, I don't think they serve alcohol here, but I believe it is B, uh, BYOB. So, a little, little pointer. But they do have some summer drinks, which all sound good. Um, when it comes to beverages, I'm a little boring. Give me a cranberry juice orange juice something simple like all of this is all good and everything but it's too fancy for me alrighty so this location is really cute it's huge too like it's really open and inviting and it's bright and I just love it I love it I'm all about a good atmosphere yes Sabrina's cafe yes Alrighty, friends, food is here. Now look at these French toasts. Let me get lower for you. Look at the height on that thing. It's hefty. Like, it, that's just eggs. Ain't nothing special. But this French toast, it smells amazing. It looks amazing. I give you angles. Angles on angles. Yes. Okay. Bon appetit time. Alrighty, friends, here we go. Time to eat now. If you watch my previous episode, you know that I like my syrup warm. However, this is not warm, but it's okay. We're not gonna hold it against them. We're still gonna eat. Let's watch the drizzle. Oh, well, let's get closer so you can see the drizzle. You ready? Here we go. Drizzle. Drizzle, drizzle, drizzle. I love syrup. Don't judge me, okay? Don't do it. All right, let me put you back. Alrighty, so let's dig in. We're gonna cut this French too. Cut this French toast. Hey, cut this French too. Cut this French toast. Hey, hey. And here we are. Uh huh, uh huh. It is thick. Now they had a stuffed version. It was stuffed with cream cheese and bananas. I love cream cheese. I don't like bananas. So I passed. But this is still good. Either way. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Like. 
I got some chocolate chips on here. I haven't eaten all day. So I am really happy that my first meal of the day is some delicious ass French toast. Oh, I mean, delicious French toast, sorry. But it's so soft and sweet, but not overpowering sweet. Like, if I really wanted to, I would need a whole bottle of sugar to spread on this entire thing. That's how spongy the French toast is. Most definitely. Most definitely. Let's do it. Mm -hmm. Let's have some eggs. We love to just regular old eggs. So you gotta season it up a little bit. And then black pepper. A little bit of salt. Not too much. Just a little bit. It's nothing worse than salty eggs. Technically, you don't even need egg salt. But I like a little hit. You know? You know? You know? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Alright, so. Let me finish my breakfast. And then we'll do a review. Alright? Alright, so another good thing about Sabrina's is that they have vegan and vegetarian options. Well, I think a lot of restaurants do. But I'm sure they put just as much of love and attention into those options as their regular menu options. So that's a plus. A plus plus. Alrighty, so I am halfway done. I have two pieces of French toast left and a little bit of eggs. I'm going to talk about the eggs really quick. Um, for being two eggs, it was a good amount. Okay, good, good amount of eggs, and they were light and they were fluffy, and they, I don't like my eggs, I wouldn't say they were moist, but I also wouldn't say they were dry, they were, they were perfect, <laughs> they were literally perfect eggs, um, if I decided to put cheese in it, I think it would have just set it over the edge, made it even more perfect, however, it was good, but it's just a regular egg. Gotta watch my cheese intake or my dairy intake, I should say. But, um, yeah, I'm happy. As you all know, food makes me happy. So, yeah, we're gonna get a box and then we'll wrap it all up again. Alrighty, friends, so this is the bill. I had a server named Matt, he was really sweet, and I, I got a cranberry juice. And then my French toast, and I added chocolate chips onto it. Um, two eggs, and so my total came out to be sixteen dollars and seventy-seven cents. Not bad. Like on average, this is the price you might pay for a breakfast if you went to IHOP or Cracker Row, you know. And then you also have to include your tip. Always, always, always tip your server. Coming from a former server, tip your server. It is so important to tip your server, okay? Regardless of if they did a great job or not, you should always tip them. If they weren't that great, at least leave them 10%. Something. Never not tip them. Please. Alrighty, friends. So this episode is complete. We are done. I got my check. Oh, that's awkward. I got my check. I got my box. I'm ready to go. And yeah, so giving you a heads up, August is a very busy month for me. So I'm definitely going to try and stay on top of these videos. Keep you coming back for more. So until we meet again, see you next time at the kitchen table. Have a nice one.